Okay, now when those surfaces come together, they create normal edges. It's where uh, two surfaces come together. So identifying these shared edges is important visualization tool. So a normal edge will appear as a point in one view and either a horizontal or a vertical true length line in the other views. So here we have a point and when we project across we see an edge that matches up with it all the way across but when we look in the top view we see that it takes a turn a right turn so this edge and this edge match in dimension okay so that's a common edge created by the junction of a vertical and horizontal surface or a side and a top surface note the point circled in the front view this edge will be 3 4 in the side and 1 2 in the top the horizontal length in the side view is the same as the vertical length in the top view so now another chart to memorize and we just kind of throw it at you all at once but if you have a point in the front view that will create a vertical line in the top and a horizontal line in the side if they are normal point in the top view look what happens we have a vertical and vertical line in the two adjacent views and then a point in the side view creates a horizontal and horizontal line uh, in the adjacent to front and top view. So memorize the chart. Remember that once again if it's a point or a surface in the top view they will have opposing uh, lines or surfaces vertical and horizontal. If it's a point or surface in the top or side view they will have matching uh, directional or orientation of surfaces. So vertical for uh, the top view and then horizontal for any point in the side view.